Bye. Bye. Have a nice day. Do you want the dog? Uh, do, you want the dog? do I want the dog? Yeah, he can stay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can lock the door. Do you want the door locked? Yeah, it's fine. Should we put the tree on? Should we put the tree on? Make it all cosy. <sighs> That's better. What do you think? What do you think? Do you think we should tidy up your toys? Hmm? Good morning. Welcome back to another Vlogmas. Hang on, let me just turn the TV down. I'm not watching shopping channels. What is it on a weekend? I just get sucked into the shopping channels. I just like to watch them. Not that I necessarily buy anything. I mean, or that we did buy that light up Christmas tree that we've got in the dining room from QVC. But I don't know. I just get hooked on just watching the shopping channel especially at christmas with all the gifts and stuff anybody else or just me um anyway it is saturday morning it is what time is it it's half past nine i am having a nice lazy morning i need to go and wash my hair <laughs> um have a shower chris is in bed though he got in he got in from work about two hours ago so i thought well, i'll let him have a good like chunk of sleep before i have a shower actually i might have a shower in in um mum's bathroom save disturbing him um anyway i'm just talking out loud now um yeah i've got no plans today i've had a lazy morning i have no plans all weekend uh and I love it. I love it. I, uh, hang on, let me turn the telly down a little bit more. Um, yeah, I made a conscious effort this, this time around, this Christmas, to just have easy weekends. Although, admittedly, I was supposed to go to Winchester today to go to one of my lovely friends' book launches, um, Mum About Town. If you follow her on Instagram, um, she's releasing a book. Um, I'll leave the link below if you're interested, if you follow her. Um, she's really lovely. Um, I was supposed to go to the book launch um, and Mum was going to come with me, but she's had to go to work and there are no trains today so um that was the only thing that i was going to do this weekend go to winchester go to the book launch um i have a mooch around the shops there with mum um because it's really pretty in winchester and they've got like the cathedral there um but yeah sadly haven't been able to go today um so yeah a lazy lazy morning but i'm gonna have a productive are you okay what's with the poor do you want some love and affection? Oh, a car's just shut their door. Um, <clears throat> what was I saying? Yeah, I'm going to have a productive afternoon because I need to sort out the office because that's just become a bit of a dumping ground for everything, like decorations, like crafty bits. Um, yeah, it's just a lot of... It needs tidying. Um, and then I've got some social media bits to do today that I need to get on and do um and just some general admin stuff so yeah um come along for <laughs> whatever today brings i need to take take you out for a w-a-l-k a w-a-l-k -A yeah not quite yet though i need to get ready i need to put some oh i need to put some layers on because it's freezing outside it's so cold um, oh, and I need to, I'm going to have my little gin cocktail, if you saw the last vlog, in my um, Christmas tree glass that I, it's in the freezer. So we'll do that. Anyway, right, I'm going to drink my coffee, peruse QVC a little bit more, and then make myself look presentable. Oh, I'm a bit flushed here. Yeah, make myself look a bit more presentable. I completely forgot to show you this in the last vlog but um yeah i made this the other day i cut the text so that's just white vinyl so i cut that on my cricut machine and then we bought this garland from the range and i had the christmas tree blackboard and um yeah so i've put it there in place of the heart for now but <laughs> I think I might swap it because the tree was over there. I think I might put it back over there because um, it looks really bare over there now and I do kind of miss 
miss the heart that is like a prominent feature for here isn't it the heart of the home so i might put that back up but yeah i just wanted to share my little creation that i did so it's midday i'm still not showered i'm still not dressed but i have a nice tidy office now look nice and tidy you can see the floor there are no bags or boxes everywhere i've moved a couple of bags there but i need to sort through those because those are the bits that we're gonna um take for christmas this year so all the bits and bobs that i've been buying for the table presents and then i've put some games in there that we're going to take but i want to put everything into a box um they're the crackers that we're going to take as well um and talking of boxes good timing because i can use this box so whilst i was tidying up i had a delivery this this is from Kyla. Uh, if you didn't know, we are doing an advent calendar for each other. Um, she should have already had hers. So we're doing 12 gifts. Mine are, so the first 11 gifts are just tiny little things. And then the main present is her Christmas present. So that's number 12. Um, so that's what I've spent the most money on. So the other things are just, just little bits. Um, and so yeah, my box has arrived today, although she did say there might be one thing missing that will follow. But anyway, let's open her up. Oh, this is exciting. Ooh. <laughs> I've got lots of uh, candle, <laughs> candle wrap. Oh, smells nice in here. It smells Christmassy. Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh my god. Oh, I love the wrapping paper. She's got constellation wrapping paper. Look at this. Is that gonna focus? I'm gonna focus. How pretty is that? So this is number eleven. <laughs> right. I'm gonna take them all out of the box. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Oh, they're all here. Oh, okay, so it did turn up in time, so I don't have to wait for an extra one. So I've got my my 12, my 12 advent gifts here. Also, there's a, a little something for Chris from Lee to the Chris, the Chris for the Chris. That's like an, an in-joke, basically. I think it stems from years ago, Milo, when he was like dinky, said something about oh is the chris coming like when we were going to visit and it's just kind of stuck the chris because he called him the chris um so that's from lee chris is yet to buy lee's christmas present the guys do their own thing it's always been a they always buy their own birthday presents buy their own christmas presents and send it to each other um and me and kyla do ours um and i've also got something for the kids as well so when chris has his Christmas present for Lee. I'll send another box over to you, Kyla. But anyway, uh, here's my 12 presents. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this is exciting. I do love the wrapping paper. Right, let's, shall we open the first one? Even though I'm looking very disheveled, I'm excited. Um, so, number one. Actually, I can open two, can't I? Because it's the second today. Can open two. Um, right, number one. Let's start with the handcrafted because they're time sensitive. Hmm. Is it a candle? Do you know what? The first gift that I got her is also time sensitive. Um, although mine, mine are not handcrafted, unfortunately. Um, right. Ooh. They're wrapped very tightly what oh my god oh these are like reese's peanut butter cups she sent me a very random text saying i can't remember if you like peanut butter or not and i like peanut butter oh cute oh i'll be devouring those and a bracelet merry vlogmas this is very like i think that's upside down very taylor swift-esque isn't it love that 
Um, that would have been just enough for the first one, but, oh, I think I know what this is now. I have, it's a candle. I think it's a candle. But I think I have to burn this specifically because there's something inside. Oh my goodness, that smell. Oh, here's me going, oh, that smells great. Can you smell it? <laughs> oh, that smells so nice. Yeah, there's something, there's something in this. I'll burn that later. Right, that's number one. Oh my goodness. My number one seems shit now. <laughs> right, number two. I heard you might be missing something. I heard you might be missing something. Shut up. Are you joking? Look. The one that we're missing. Oh, and it's a really pretty colour as well. Do you know what? So many people messaged me on Instagram, because I said about it, and said, you can get them on eBay. I never thought about going on eBay to see if I could get a 2020 ball ball. I think I just assumed that because of the pandemic, they just were not doing them. Um, but I've got it, I can add it to the tree now. We have got a 2020 ball ball, it's a toilet roll. <laughs> but now we've got a Harrods one to complete our collection. Thank you, Kyla, that's so, so thoughtful. Oh my God, handmade gifts, a ball ball. Mine seems so crap now, but I promise the last present is the one. Anyway. Right, I'm gonna go and have a shower now. Oh, all right, let's do some washing. Hello, Charlie. Come to help me. You come to help me. I'm on a dog walk now. Look. He's alive. He's alive. He's alive. Oh, yeah, back on a night shift again tonight. But um, I've come for a little walk, and it's so cold. This is how cold it is. And the cobwebs. We're just in Aldi looking at some of the Christmas food. What's that? Rump steak with pigs in the. Pigs in blankets butters. Oh, is that like bacon? Pigs in blanket flavour butter. Butter. What else have they got? Yorkshire pudding. Pigs in blanket. Wrap. What, what are these? Chili and lime breaded chicken nuggets. Ooh. Yeah, they are kind of obsessed with pigs in blankets this year, aren't they, Aldi? A quiche. Look at these. Kevin the current Volivant cases. Is this the equivalent of the M&S Bucks Fizz? Orange and pomegranate? Well, there's no cranberry, it's orange and pomegranate. So it is quarter to five. Chris has gone back to bed for a bit. I thought it was time to crack out the Christmas mugs. Uh, I've got a cup of tea. I've got my candle burning that I got in my advent calendar. So that's all. Burning away, smells lovely. There's definitely coconut in there. Definitely, one of my favorites. Uh, and I'm gonna watch, if it'll focus, this, Genie. It's a new one that's just come onto Sky Cinema. Richard Curtis Sky original festive com comedy about a genie, a man, and landing a chance to fix the mess that you've made of life. Let's... Let's see what this is like. Well, cheers <laughs> from me and my little Christmas tree drink, my little droopy Christmas tree. It's gone a bit, it's gone a bit sad looking, hasn't it? But 
I tried. I tried. But anyway, a gin and lemonade is a gin and lemonade. I've never been a gin and tonic person. It's got to be lemonade for me. Uh, anyway, I'm going to say goodbye for this vlogmas. I hope you've enjoyed. I'm going to cook some dinner. Um, and then by the time dinner's ready, Chris will be awake. And um, yeah, just going to chill out the rest of the evening. It's just me and Charlie tonight because mum's gone bingo. And then by the time Chris leaves to work, I'll probably watch another Christmas film or something. Uh, Jeannie, it was okay. It was just okay. Wouldn't. It was just, you know, fair. Fair to middling. It was all right. It wasn't like one of the best, but it wasn't the worst. Um, but yeah, right. Let's start some dinner and I will see you guys in another couple of days. Take care. I'll see you soon. Bye. Oh, that's nice. Hang on. I'm back. Um, these were in front of me and I thought, oh, I'm going to try one of these homemade Reese's buttercups. I'll have one of these, then I'll do the dinner whilst I'm having my gin. They are incredible. They are incredible i would say even better than an actual reese's put butternut cup kyla these are a 10 out of 10 10 out of 10 oh.